Hey, so I'm going to talk about five simple steps that you should keep in mind when you're looking to purchase a residential property in Dubai. You can technically apply these to buying a property anywhere in the world. You can actually sit, for example, in Mumbai and purchase a property in Toronto. Just follow, just follow these simple five steps that I'm going to narrate to you. Okay, so it's very simple. The broad strokes, if you're kind of like going along this process, you're going to be okay at the end of the day. Okay, so follow the process, be organized. That's the main message of this video. Okay, and obviously, come and get in touch with us. There's a link below to purchase a property in Dubai. Me and my team would love to help you out. Okay, we've been doing this for 15 plus years. We know our way around the Dubai market to make sure that we're benefiting you. Show real first. All right, guys, welcome back. So essentially speaking, now, these are five broad steps. There's a lot of stuff in the middle, but I'm not going to get into the nitty gritty because I think it becomes a really boring, long video. I want to make it really intact to the point. If you need more help, get in touch with us. Be happy to help you. The first thing that you must do as a buyer of a residential property or an investor into a residential property, or for that matter, commercial as well, do a needs analysis okay okay so essentially speaking i'll tell all my investors have a long term money making plan with no surprises in the middle essentially speaking i always tell them you're going to do something called a personal plan that's for p you're going to do something called a financial plan that's for f and you're going to do something called a dubai real estate plan that's the dre okay so the pfdre your essential needs are where your personal, financial, and your Dubai real estate plan intersect. That's the overlap, okay? Now, seems simple enough, right? Never, even you can do this, okay? Technically, you can. However, what you need when you're establishing your personal needs is an expert. Can you see that? Can you see that, okay? That expert is super, super critical, okay? That expert of the local market is the one who's going to actually answer your fears, explain to you what works, what doesn't work, so on and so forth, okay? If I'm going investing, when I'm investing in the Toronto market, I use an expert. When I'm investing in the Pakistani market, I use an expert. When I invest in Calcutta, or Kolkata, eh? Kolkata. Okay, when I go and invest in Kolkata, I'm going to use a local expert that's guided to me by my friends and family over there, okay? If you want an expert locally here in Dubai, reach out to us, okay? So the first thing you would do is establish your needs analysis. What happens in the needs analysis? How many bedrooms do you want? What's more important, beach or city? Is the school more important? Is going to work more important? You know, maybe you work from home. Maybe you wish to spend a little bit, not too much. That comes under financial. And then the Dubai real estate. The expert need will be the one guiding you, okay? Now, in Dubai, after you've done your needs analysis, what's going to happen is you're going to be able to then... Oh, by the way, at the expert stage, you should do that before the needs analysis and assign an expert, okay? Now, the expert or if you are yourself an expert, you're going to then look at establishing if you want to buy something on the off-plan market or from the ready market. Both have their pros and cons. And again, both are going to be born out of this. What's your financial capability? Perhaps you can't pay all the money in one go. Maybe you've got, maybe you want to wish to buy something that's 5 million dirhams, which is about $1.5 million, but you've only got 500,000 dirhams or three or a hundred or hundred fifty thousand dollars at the moment, right? So maybe you need some financial maneuvering, some structuring, maybe a bank involved, maybe going the off plan play off plan way is better for you. All of that, guess who's gonna help you? The expert's gonna guide you and he's gonna answer, okay? Obviously, you're going to after this dealing you'll be dealing with a lot of brokers, okay? 
and the sales staff of the developers. Now, here's the, here's the thing. You can go up to dealing with 5, 10, 15, 20 good, bad, ugly brokers. And you can be dealing with 5, 10, 15, 20 good, bad, ugly sales people at the developer's office. Look, have an expert appointed who deals with all of this, the good, bad, and the ugly that comes with it, okay? And because the expert's working with you so closely, he knows the exact plan that's gonna meet your needs. But sometimes, you know, I'll tell you something. I, as an expert, would be able to guide you into the process, and I can buy, bring you one or two properties that just make sense, but, you know, sometimes I'll still go through seven to 12 properties just to make sure what I've done over here with you in the needs analysis makes sense, right? Because until you sometimes see what's available, you might not be able to make the right call, okay? So we'll still look 7, 12, sometimes 15 properties, you know, just to make sure that we're in the right direction. We'll whittle it down to one, two, or three, and from this we'll whittle it down to one property, okay? That's the process, okay? So that's the process you should be following as well, right? Not haphazard, okay? After you've been dealing with brokers, you do the property selection, okay? Which I just explained over here. That's how a structured process works, okay? I've got something called the FDG value matrix, okay? Put all the properties in that. If you want access to this, hey, there's a link below, work with us. We'll give you access to the FDG value matrix, okay? Uh, the FDG value matrix allows you to assess a property on a lot of uh, variables, about 10 to 15 variables. I'm always adding more variables, yeah? And then what you do from the FDG value matrix is, you know, you go through the selection process and then see which one property or two properties make sense. I essentially, when we're working with our investors, we do five things on it which is essentially speaking, selection, evaluation, due diligence, qualifying or disqualifying as per the needs analysis. Last but not the least, the most crit critical part, bring the property home, okay? Now, this in itself can have a long video involved in it in terms of what the steps are going to be. It's, uh, there could be a lot of steps. You might have banks that you're dealing with. You might have uh, the other brokers that you're dealing with, you might have the developers, agents you're dealing with, the SBA sales and purchase agreement. There's many, 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 many tons of things, right? Now, don't get scared though, okay? Don't get scared because while you can do all of this, all of this, you know, even if you're a fumbling, mumbling, first time investor in the Dubai market, follow these steps. Loosely speaking, you will be able to get through, but if you have an expert appointed with you in your corner looking at for your interest, then that expert, myself, with 10 plus years of experience, or anybody else from the market who's transparent, honest, and competent will guide you to that perfect purchase in the residential market. So look, don't get scared of the Dubai market. There is an ocean and plethora of properties available. I agree. However, have an expert guide you through the process so you are coming out on the other end a winner. All right, you wanna work with us? Hit the link below. Ciao for now, bye. Hey guys, thank you for watching the video. I hope you liked it. My name is Fad Daud. I've been doing this for 15 plus years. I started in uh, Toronto, Canada in 2006 and since 2007 I've been based in Dubai and doing real estate in Dubai. Look, if you're looking to work with me, there's a form below and my mobile number. I do paid consulting. You can also uh, get help for, uh, from my team for services. If you like the video, press the like button, press the subscribe and the bell icon and share it with uh, your friends who you feel would be able to benefit from the content of this video. Last but not the least, I'll repeat, me and my team's role is always going to be to help and select the best property for you. Your role will be to invest in that property and we will in turn invest in your life and your future. Bye for now. Guys, what's going on? Yeah, five basic steps. Okay. I thought it was energy.
Okay, okay, okay. Where you go? Hey, so I'm gonna talk about. F okay, wait, wait, wait. Cut.